Svalbard. If you are looking for the real Arctic adventures close to the North Pole, visit Svalbard, which is one of the largest untouched wilderness areas in the world. A top starting point for travelers is Longyearbyen, which belongs to the world's northmost settlements and is a gateway to the nature-based experiences in Svalbard. This cosmopolitan Arctic town has many hotels, bars, and restaurants where you can enjoy food and drinks surrounded by majestic mountains and nature. Taste grilled Atlantic cod with potato salad and beans. It is delicious. In order to stay safe, make sure to be accompanied by a professional guide when you go outside from Longyearbyen to explore Svalbard's Arctic wilderness. You can do it driving a snowmobile or go dog sledding and admire the white covered Arctic desert at a pleasant pace powered only by your new four-legged friends. Dogs are very friendly. Love extra attention and playing with them is addictive. On your expedition, you can meet one of the world's largest carnivores, the polar bear, which is also known as the king of the Arctic. Meet also walruses resting on floating blocks of ice. However, they can be very sensitive to people being too close or boats. To observe them safely, remember to travel on organized tours with local guides. While polar bears and walruses, you can observe in Svalbard all year long. It is only from late April to August when you can see here Atlantic puffins, which are easily recognizable thanks to their famous colorful bills. Did you know that their life expectancy is 30 years or even more? Do not miss the Svalbard Global Seed Vault, which is the world's largest storage of duplicates of seed samples from the world's crop collections. It is not open, but a guide can take you close to the entrance where seeds are stored at a temperature of negative 18 degrees Celsius. Another worthwhile attraction is the abandoned Soviet coal mining town, Pyramiden. Today, a ghost town. In its heyday, it used to be a settlement of over 1,000 inhabitants. It is well-preserved thanks to the cold climate, and it is becoming a popular tourist attraction. There is also a hotel with a restaurant and a souvenir shop. If you've enjoyed this video and want to see more in the future, leave a comment, give a like, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.